Hi, I'm Ryan from Intersync Products, and today I'm here to talk to you about the MetXT Power Bar and the MetXT Competition Plates. So the MetXT is a new product line for us. Um, it also includes the rack up stand beside, which we have a different video about, um, as well as some collars, competition collars, and some uh, quick magnetic clips as well, which we'll cover a bit later. So first we'll start with the barbell. Uh, the barbell is um, a standard powerlifting barbell, so it has 81 centimeter knurling marks, so standard marks for powerlifting. Uh, it has a narrow um, sleeve end, allowing the plates to get nice and close to the center of gravity. Um, it is 29 millimeters, so standard thickness for a barbell in competition as well. Um, overall, we've had a demo of this bar for about a year, so I've squatted on it quite a bit. Um, I've been up into uh, the 350 to 360 kilo range on it, and it is a very stiff bar. The one big difference is it is a chromed bar, so the chrome will give it a little protection against rusting and stuff. Standard competition bars cannot be chromed, so um, the chroming makes the knurling a little bit softer, but I would define the knurling on this as still quite aggressive. It has a, um, a more coarse knurling compared to a finer knurling you see on some barbells. This would be a coarser knurling, and to me, it's as grippy as you need it to be. Um, I've never had issues uh, when deadlifting. The chroming will help protect it against rusting in a, a humid environment. The one thing we will always recommend is anytime you have chalk sitting on the bar, to just use a, a, a hard bristle nylon brush and clean that off. The chalk will hold moisture against the barbell and it'll um, encourage rusting over time. So we clean our bars after every use just to make sure that that uh, uh, doesn't happen. The nice thing about uh, the MedXT rack that I'm standing in front of as well is that it has plastic rollers, so they will also protect the barbell from getting smoothed out where it sits in the rack. If you're gonna put it into a power cage with, uh, with steel um, J-hooks or another rack on the market with a steel uh, cup, it will smooth out that knurling. There's not much you can do about it. Uh, we recommend trying to use racks with plastic rollers or plastic J-cups to protect and, and, and keep the longevity of your barbell. So as I said, we've had this bar for about a year. Uh, we've been very happy with it. I've squat quite heavy on it and it's very stiff. Everyone else in the gym that squat with it, um, you know, up into that 300 kilo range has all, have also the same thing. It's very stiff. We've used it, you know, extensively throughout the year and everyone's been really impressed with it, especially given the price point for it. Uh, it does stack up, in my opinion, with uh, some of the best bars in the market. The barbell is made to IPF specifications, so it's the proper length. As I said, the markings are 81 centimeters, as is standard in competition. The sleeves are um, very tight, so when you first get it, you might find your plates are a little harder to get on. Um, it might, it should wear in over time and allow that to, to smooth out a bit, but they are very tight tolerances on all the specs on this bar. So we've been very happy with this bar. Uh, we think you'll love it. Um, it's a great addition to any home gym or any bar, uh, uh, commercial gym. Quickly, I'll talk about the plate set as well. Um, so as you can see, uh, maybe better over on this angle, the plates come in the standard uh, powerlifting dominations. So red 20 kilos, blue 20 kilos, yellow 15, green 10, uh, white 5, black 2.5, and silver 1.25, or chromed 1.25. So your standard colors you see out there on the market, um, again the plates are made to power off specifications, they are calibrated, they are calibrated within the tolerances of the IPF, so excellent plates to use to ensure that you're lifting the weights you think you're lifting, um, and to help you get ready for, for a competition. So. The plates have been good, they've held up well, the, the paint is uh, automotive grade paint and uh, we found it to hold up as well or better than any of the plates we've seen on the market. So um, we've been very happy with them as well and uh, yeah, they're an excellent set to add to your collection. Uh, one thing I don't have here is uh, the 0.5 kilo and the 0.25 kilo uh, considered record plates or chips. Um, they also, we also have those as well and uh, they also come in the, the chromed style as the 1.25 is um, and those are nice to add even if you just need them to throw in your gym bag 
if you're uh, a lighter weight lifter or you're lifting lower weights, it's nice to have the ability to make a smaller jump when especially working something like a bench press where you know making a five pound jump is you know quite a bit for, for certain people. And to have that ability to make that um, smaller jump is nice to have. So those can be useful to throw into your gym bag and carry on with you as well. So those are available. I just don't have them on the bar here. Um, next I'll talk about the uh, quick clip I have on here. Um, we call it the magnetic quick clip. So common design, um, a really secure snapping clip, rubber on the inside, really grippy. And uh, all of the outside uh, ring here on both sides is magnetic. So if you want to store them on a rack, you can just simply attach them to the rack. They'll stay, stay together. Um, they'll also, if you grab both of them, um, you can magnet them together as well and they'll just throw together in your bag. Um, we found them to be very secure. Uh, they, they grip on real tight and uh, definitely keep your plates from moving around. Um, so they've been a nice addition as well. Uh, we've had good feedback on these. So nice addition to your gym bag as well. If you train in a gym that has spring clips that may be a little loose, throwing these in your bag can really help to, you know, keep you safe while you're training. So yeah, I think we've covered everything. Uh, the bar, the plates, the quick clips, the collars I don't have uh, with me, as well as the Met XT rack are all in stock here uh, at the present moment. And um, they are available on our website, intertankprox.ca. And if you have any questions, you can leave them down in the comments below. We have a video about the rack as well, which we'll throw a link to in the description. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video.